Corporal Joe Drago was involved in some of the most storied action in World War II history, and he just happened to live next door. My whole life I thought I knew Drago. He was a grouch. Whenever the kids in the neighborhood played baseball in the street and a foul ball landed in his yard, he was always short with us, the stereotypical mean old neighbor that most have pity on but also steer away from. It wasn't until I became a Marine that Drago ever really warmed up to me, and by warmed up I mean that he waved to me occasionally from his porch. Ever the consummate grouch. Now I know that it was more complex than that. Drago served alongside Corporal James Day, whose heroic actions were recognized by the United States government when President Bill Clinton awarded him the Congressional Medal of Honor. Day and Drago served in the same division, the 6th Marine Division. They participated in the Second World War's most ferocious battles. They sometimes spoke of their guilt and deep remorse for the civilians that were killed during the Battle of Okinawa on the tiny Japanese island. Some 100,000 civilians died, caught in the middle of the 82-day battle. Day was credited with killing over a 100 Japanese soldiers with a light machine gun during the battle. Some civilians were interspersed among the enemy army. Some there on purpose, some by accident, and others forcibly conscripted by the Imperial Japanese Army. Drago and Day didn't care whether civilians or professional soldiers came into their sights, and neither did the Marines.